Hey, it's Sari here. How are you doing? Hopefully you're doing well. In today's video, I actually wanted to do something a bit different. Uh, in this video, I wanted to give my review for Screencast-O-Matic. Uh, if you've been following this channel long enough, you know that I've been doing a lot of these videos where I've been recording my computer screen and also my face. Um, and Screencast-O-Matic happens, happens to be the exact screen recorder that I've been using to make a lot of these videos. So uh, when I talk about affiliate marketing, when I... Um, you know, talked about, you know, sites like ClickBank and all that type of stuff. Uh, Screencast-O-Matic is the exact screen recorder that I've actually been using to record videos on my YouTube channel. So uh, if you are completely brand new to this, uh, if you are new to this channel, if this is the first video you're seeing, uh, you know, if you are, you know, doing some research on Screencast-O-Matic, uh, if you are interested in learning how to make money online and you want to uh, learn about, you know, affiliate marketing, how to promote products, all that type of stuff, that is primarily what my channel is all about, so feel free to hit that subscribe button and be sure to take that bell notification to get notified of all the new videos that I post on this channel. But without further ado, let's talk about Screencast-O-Matic. So what is Screencast-O-Matic exactly? Well, I kind of uh, went over that already, but Screencast-O-Matic is pretty much a software that allows you to record your computer screen, and it's pretty much great for, you know, if you're doing any sort of, you know, product reviews, or if you're, you know, if you're doing, like, some sort of, like, video tutorial on where you're, you, you want to show your computer screen... Uh, Screencast-O-Matic is one of those uh, softwares that you could use to record your computer screen. Now, there's plenty of other ones out there that I've also tried as well. Uh, but Screencast-O-Matic, I feel, is by far the easiest one to, uh, to use, uh, at least in my experience. I felt I found that it's very simple, very newbie-friendly. Um, you know, you don't have to be you know tech-savvy to really understand it at all. You can pretty much just uh, create a free account. And uh, as you can see, I'm currently logged in here. I do have some videos uh, currently right down here. This is for a um, a free training that I was putting together, which if you want to learn more about that, uh, the first link in the description will get you access to my free training for affiliate marketing. So this is actually, I use this uh, screen recorder to record videos uh, for that specific training. So it's a four-day training series that I wanted to put together. And Screencast-O-Matic was what I used to put those videos together. So I'm currently logged in right now. Um, and then uh, the plan that I'm currently on is the Solo Premiere. So this is about $48 a year, which when you think about it, uh, compared to a lot of the other uh, screen recorders out there, uh, this is actually very cheap, very, very inexpensive. And this is actually their most expensive plan. So they have uh, this plan here. And then they also have the Pro uh, version, which is also, which is about uh, 150 a month. Uh, you know, per year you, you pay like a yearly face, a yearly fee. Unless if you decide to go with, I think it's like a three-year um, plan, it would be like one dollar per month. So it'd be like 36 bucks for, you know, three years access to uh, Screencast-O-Matic. So um, that's actually very good. And I've, act I've actually tried a few other um, softwares out there, a few other screen recorders. Um, I've tried... Uh, Filmora 9, I've tried Mova V, I've also tried, uh, there's one other one I kind of forgot the name of. Uh, then I've also tried the free uh, screen recorder inside of Windows, where if you press the Windows button in the G letter, it, you know, has like a free screen recorder that's like, you know, kind of for Xbox, but uh, this is actually uh, what I found is the uh, easiest, most newbie-friendly one to use. And the issue that I've always had with um, other ones that I've tried in the past, and I don't know if this is like an issue with this PC or I don't know what it is uh, with me, but I've tried other screen recorders and, you know, other ones, of course, I, you know, paid actually more money uh, than I did with this, actually. And oftentimes what I would do is, you know, I would test it out, I would record a video, and then when I would watch the video back, all of a sudden it would be, you know, lagging like crazy. I could, you know, my voice would be chopping up, um, you know, the, the video, like, it would, it would, uh, the frame rate was, like, very low, and I was hardly, it was just, like, you know, like, still images, like, it would just kind of, you know, it was almost like, uh, I don't know, it was, like, very frustrating, and I was like, okay, well, you know, here I'm trying to put these videos together, I want to, you know, create these, uh, videos, but because these other, um, softwares that I tried, they weren't really working in my experience, I mean, I'm not saying that they're bad, it's just, in my personal experience, they weren't really working as well, I wasn't able to, get out a lot of these videos as consistent, but when I found Screencast-O-Matic, in my experience, I tried it, I seen that they had a free uh, plan, uh, which actually I'll go to the, um, I'm going to try logging out right here, and then I'll I'll show you the different uh, plans they have available, just so you can get kind of a better idea, but, um, oh yeah, so here here we go, you could uh, start recording for free, uh, try your video editor, um, shows I'm currently logged in now, I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to log out real quick, just to kind of show you exactly what 
the uh, home page looks like. So uh, you could actually uh, get this for free, actually. You can get Screencast-O-Matic, and it's available on uh, Windows. It's available on Macs and also available on Chromebooks. So if you have any of those three, um, you know, computers, um, you can you can get Screencast-O-Matic on there. And then they also have a uh, mobile app that you can get on your phone as well. So if you search your app store, you know, iTunes, Google Play, whatever, you know, whatever app store you've got on your phone, uh, you can just search, search up Screencast-O-Matic. And then they also have an app that you can get on your mobile phone. And then uh, you could even um, record your uh, phone screen as well, which I think is very convenient. You have it. You have it both on your computer, and then you have your. Uh, you can also record videos on your phone as well, which I think is very good because you know, it's great to have you know one where it's like kind of, um, it kind of you know kind of uh, does like you know kind of all in one type of thing. Uh, that that that's another thing I really like about it. Um, and then also, oh yeah, I, I also want to go over the uh, the pricing, the different plans. Let me see if I could uh, look through the different. Um, Okay, so I'll just go to pricing here, and I'll show the different uh, plans that they have available. Uh, so I'll let that load up, and there's solo plans and team plans. Um, so as as I mentioned, uh, Screencast-O-Matic is you can get that for free. You can get a free version. You can test it out yourself. And if you want to check out uh, Screencast-O-Matic for yourself, you want to test it out for yourself. I will have a link uh, somewhere in the description where you could actually uh, check out Screencast-O-Matic for yourself. You could uh, test it out. You could see if you like it or not. Um, I know you'll like it uh, if you uh, if you give it a try. It's very simple and very newbie friendly. Uh, but then the uh, the two uh, paid uh, versions uh, is the deluxe, and then there is premier. So I'm currently on the premier plan, which is uh, four dollars per month. Again, very cheap. Otherwise, there's also the deluxe version. The of course of course the more expensive one has you know more features, but um, advanced record and video editing, easy video editor, uh, record uh, computer audio. Uh, import narration and music, script recordings, draw zoom, screen ca screenshot tool, create captions, green screen filter, um, and then this one, it's got all those other features except, you know, they got a new stock lab library. Uh, you could um, automatically transfer um, iPhone and iPad videos to editor, uh, secure backup for recordings, branded ad free site, uh, video playlist using channels, um, plus all deluxe features of course um, so the the two um, I, I ended up going well originally I, I went with the uh, deluxe version and uh, I think if you go with deluxe they also give you the option to uh, get it for like a uh, build like every three years actually where it's uh, 36 bucks for uh, three years uh, you know to have access to this which again is insanely insanely cheap especially when you compare it with all the other ones out there, which in my experience I found just did not work as well for me. Um, so this is actually very cheap, and um, you know that's the thing that I really like about it. So Screencast-O-Matic, again, very cheap. Um, I'm cur I currently have it open right now. Uh, as you can see, it says I'm currently uh, recording, so I'm going to leave that on. I've got a few videos that you could just barely see in the background, but uh, if you could see this enough, uh, basically how it would work is you would open up Screencast-O-Matic, and when you download it, it downloads uh, this little icon on your desktop. Uh, when you open it up, you've got this page here, except this little thing won't be here if, if you're uh, not recording. It's got your uh, all your videos that you recorded here, and then if you want to record a new video, you just click on this red uh, record button up here, and then it'll uh, automatically close this out. It'll put you know your face in the screen as well, unless if you want to either just record your screen or only record your face, you could do that as well, but otherwise, in my case, I always go with the option of recording both my screen and face. So they have that option, and then you can pretty much choose to plug in any mic that you want, you know, any external mic that you want to use as well with this. You could do that, um, and you could pretty much just kind of, you know, do any sort of tutorial, or if you're marketing any sort of, any sort of software or product, this is definitely very great for that. Uh, it works very well. Um, you could uh, also edit some videos as well. Um, I've, the one downside that I will say with Screencast-O-Matic when it comes to editing videos is that it doesn't necessarily have as many features with uh, with editing editing videos as other softwares out there, so um, that's kind of the downside with it. Um, it. You know, like for example, in my case, you know, oftentimes when I'm recording these videos and I'll watch them back, oftentimes I'll hear like, I don't know, like the fan in the background or something like that, or um, you know, something like that, where it, you know, it, my voice isn't like like I could hear my voice fine, but you know, like I hear some static or you know some sound in the background like that. So, um, you know, currently, currently right now, that could mainly be because, you know, I'm recording with 
the default mic in my PC. Um, I, you know, unless if I, you know, get a mic, which I, I did pick up a mic recently, but it wasn't working for, for whatever reason. Um, that issue could uh, be fixed if I have, you know, a mic. If you're using a mic, an external mic that you could use, and it, you know, helps with drowning out, you know, background sound, then uh, that could very easily help with, um, with, uh, you know, eliminating any sort of background noise or anything like that. But um, Screencast-O-Matic overall is a very newbie-friendly uh, screen recorder, very easy to use, uh, very inexpensive. I highly recommend it if you are doing, you know, any sort of affiliate marketing, if you're building any sort of online business, if you're creating videos and you're doing some sort of, you know, tutorials online, uh, then Screencast-O-Matic is definitely a must-have. So uh, that's pretty much my review for Screencast-O-Matic. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to let me know uh, your thoughts in the comments down below. Feel free to leave a comment letting me know your thoughts. If you plan to give this a try for yourself, again, there is a free version you can get access to and you can test it out for, uh, for yourself. Um, if you like it, you can consider going with one of the, um, the paid versions, which I highly recommend. Um, I ended up going with the Premiere version because uh, you could record videos longer than 15 minutes, whereas the Deluxe version, I think 15 minutes is the max that you could record up to. And then also they they also have the feature of, you know, you could upload a video straight from, um, from Screencast-O-Matic straight to your YouTube channel. So that's also very convenient as well. Um, and then they also have the option of um, storing your videos onto the Screencast-O-Matic platform. So when you create your account, um, you could pretty much, when you have a video that you recorded, I'm actually going to go ahead and log back in here just to kind of show you. Even though you kind of saw it in the beginning of the video, um, what you could do is once you uh, finish recording a video, you could actually upload it to um, straight to uh, your Screencast-O-Matic account where it'll pretty much be stored on here. As you can see here, I have two videos that I, I recorded earlier and I still have them uh, stored on this platform. So instead of just having it where it's taking up space on your computer, or, you know, if you don't want to uh, upload it to your YouTube channel right away, you could actually have it stored on here and you can pretty much just kind of have it, you know, available on here whenever you want to download it again and put it right on your YouTube channel. But uh, otherwise, I think that pretty much uh, covers everything for um, my review of Screencast-O-Matic. I hope you found this video helpful, as I mentioned. Um, I know I said this earlier, but, you know, feel free to leave a comment down below letting me know your thoughts uh, if you plan to give this a try yourself. And if you want to check this out for yourself, the link to Screencast-O-Matic will be in the description below. But anyways, that is my review for Screencast-O-Matic. Hopefully you enjoyed this, and take care.